Our state's congressional delegation was quick to react to the arrest today, telling WBZ's Christina Hager a special prosecutor should be allowed to forge ahead with his work. Just as President Trump calls the Russia investigation a witch hunt, one of his loudest critics, Senator Elizabeth Warren, it's the so-called witch city, Salem. I don't know of another time in the history of any presidency when something like this has happened. As America learned about charges against Paul Manafort, his associate Rick Gates and former Trump campaign aide George Papadopoulos, Massachusetts politicians lined up to support special prosecutor Robert Mueller, U.S. Representative Catherine Clark in Dorchester. We want to make sure we are protecting our democracy, and I think this is just the beginning. But in situate, Trump supporter Jeff Deal, running for Warren's Senate seat, says it won't hurt him and it doesn't hurt the president. First of all, I think Paul Manafort took part in these activities, you know, outside of uh, the campaign for presidency. That's exactly what President Trump's tweeted response refers to. He then asks, why aren't crooked Hillary and the Dems the focus? Five question marks. Jeff Deal says he's giving Mueller a chance. If he treats this even handedly and looks at the fact that it, the uh, Clinton administration or the Clinton campaign was actually involved with uh, uranium deals. I think that that would be a good sign that he's trying to be fair. But it's Massachusetts Democrats who are suddenly more protective than ever of Robert Mueller's job. The investigation has to go forward without interference. In Boston, Christina Hager, WBZ News.